from Etchy here. This is your CCC update for February 20th, 2023. That's Cooper's Critter Crew. <laughs> Nelson reports from the UK that they had very windy days and thought they may not be able to race. Storm Auto has certainly given them a battering. A lot of homes were left without power after the storm passed through. Matilda was going to start her spring cleaning, but instead they opened up their home to friends and neighbors who were in the dark. Candles aren't safe as they could easily set something on fire or someone's tail, even, in Nelson's case. <laughs> it was still windy on Catterday, but they decided to go ahead with the races. Matilda found out that it was Auntie Pam's birthday yesterday and they had previously planned a surprise party for her. It was so exciting. They had balloons, streamers, and banners for the garden around the picnic table and put them up in trees early on Sunday morning. Larry won the foot race, but he keeps himself so fit. He's single and has plenty of time to train and goes to the gym almost every day. Swen won the drone race. Swen is very competitive and hates not winning, so he has upgraded his drone and he beat everyone hands down. Matilda baked cookies, coconut and cherry cakes, and they had milk and juice. So yesterday they had the great birthday party, despite the weather still being windy, but it was warm and sunny. Auntie Pam had lots of cards and gifts, and she loves the gifts that we sent her. And, uh, and Uncle Kev surprised her with a cat from Vermont that says Vermont on it. <laughs> Can you believe it? She was so surprised and thrilled. And I think my mom must have helped Uncle Kev with that. She had lots of treats for everyone to share, and they and the humans had Chinese food. The critters love their many nuts, fruits, berries, cakes, and they had pizza, too. <laughs> I think they had enough to last all week. Uncle Kev took photos, and I'm sure he'll send some for us to see. It was a lovely time, especially since she's been ill for the last few days. They all played party games in the yard, and Uncle Kev had organized a treasure hunt for them which Nelson said was great fun, looking for clues and buried treasure. So happy birthday, Auntie Pam, again. Meanwhile, back in the U.S. of A, today is President's Day, which is a federal holiday, supposedly celebrating all presidents, but really I think it came about because two presidents were born on in February. Our very first president, George Washington, born on the 22nd, and my favorite president, Abraham Lincoln, born on the 12th, was our 16th president. So everyone has the week, a long weekend here. Squirrelitariat, oh, happy birthday to the presidents. Squirrelitariat won the foot race on Sunday, and Earl once again won the drone race. L and L were busy this week planning for and celebrating their dad Dale's birthday on Catterday. So happy birthday, Dale. Wow, this was a month full of birthdays at I can't believe it. I hope everyone has a great week, and I also hope you will be kind to one another. Cooper Marchie here. Ciao.